All right, looks like I'm first. As usual, first at everything. I'm here too, Trump, just marked as offline. Why would you do that, Obama, when you know I'm here? I think you just answered your own question. Whatever. Where's Biden? We need to start the game. I mean, he could be anywhere. We'll be lucky if he's even found his computer by now. What up, homies? It's your boy, JB. There you are. Sleepy Joe thought your dementia made you forget our meeting. You know I'm trying Trump. I really am. Now, what meeting are you talking about? Trump, did you hear me? This meeting, you mental case, right now, as we speak. Honestly, Joe, sometimes I wonder if I should have just ran for a third term instead of you running, my gosh. Whatever, guys, can we just start? I gotta go get some ice cream after this. Oh, my gosh. World War III on the horizon, and you're thinking about that. You know what you... Okay, we're starting. So I assume you guys have all seen JRP's main films? Most of them. The good ones, at least. How would you know which ones are good, Trump, if you haven't seen them all? How would you know what movie you're even watching, you dementia patient? My gosh. Joe, you... Yes, I've seen most of them as well. Okay, here we go then. Awesome. It only took us a whole half hour to start. I'm going to be late to my golf game. First movie, Sherlock Holmes uh, and the Secret of the No-Shirt Guys. Thoughts? Solid B tier. Overall, not Jonathan's best film and not a great title either, but you can't go wrong with the first JRP film, so yeah, B-tier is good. I'm not as generous as Trump. Most of the camera angles in this thing looks like Jonathan just drop-kicked the camera stand and left it wherever it landed. I say D-tier. I see both points, so we'll compromise. C-tier it is. Moving on to the next one. Paradox 1. What we thinking? Instant S-tier. No contest. Not so fast. Paradox 2 and 3 were much better. A tier might be a more suitable tier. Maybe, but they rely on the knowledge of the previous films to enjoy them. Paradox One is the best open and shut film JRP has ever made. Debatable, but I'm with Creepy Joe on this one. Let's do S tier. I can accept that. Okay, now we have a ball's journey. This honestly was my favorite JRP film, S tier for me. Okay, Joe, we can't just give out S tiers to every movie. Let's think about this for a second. A ball's journey was a great movie, but not really long enough for a lot to happen. I'll say A tier. I agree. Oh, come on, guys. This movie rocks. Joe, can't you just accept it? Me and Obama are the majority. You're outvoted. You mean just like you've accepted losing the 2020 election? Damn. I'll think about that when you can explain how your son is doing cocaine and my kids are running Fortune 500 businesses. Get back to me on that one, Joe. All right, all right, guys. Halfway there, but we have a ways to go. Our next one is Jacques Pierre, too. A nice quick film, nothing spectacular, but the ambiance worked really well. I'll say B tier. I personally love this movie, but I can see numerous filming techniques that needed to be improved. A tier for me. I wasn't a big fan, honestly. It needs a better set. If I'm generous, I'd say C tier. Well, dang, we all have different opinions. What do we do? You can just watch me as I put it in C tier. Really, Obama? Hey, you better watch it or I'll call in a drone strike on your favorite McDonald's. Wait, but I thought only the president can call in drone strikes. That's right. What, Joe, do you really think you're in charge right now? Of what? Exactly. Trump, what do we have next? Okay, we have Star Wars versus Star Trek 3. I'll start us off by saying I don't mind if I never see that movie again. Same here. The production value was already so low for the first two films, then Jonathan decided he could handle filming another movie at the same time as this one, so of course it went downhill. It has the stupidest plot ever. The Sith Lord is good now. Why? Don't worry about it. Get over it. Sounds like it's unanimous for once then. D-tier, guys? Definitely. Couldn't agree more. Nice. By the way, D stands for Democrat. Ha! Okay, next one. Trump, that was so unfunny, I almost had a brain aneurysm. You're right. It's nowhere near as funny as your presidency. Ha ha, get owned. Guys, come on. We only have one left. Inspector Sauerkraut 2. This one is what I'd call a cult classic. Not one that outsiders would like, but if you've been with JRP for a while, you'll love it. As much as I hate to say it, Donald's right on the money. More like in the money. Trump. Because rich. For the love of God, just stop, please, while I still have some sanity left. I never saw this one. F tier. Whoa, Joe. We don't even have an F tier, you moron. And what, so you automatically downgrade any movie you haven't seen? Yeah, Joe, why don't you just stay out of this and let us vote then? Trump, we thinking A tier? Now B is better especially to be fair to the other films. I guess I can see that. All right, B tier it is. Well, looks like that wraps up today's rankings then. Will we do this again sometime? I hope so. It really depends how many views this gets. Wait, we're on TV? I didn't agree to that. You're the president, Joe. You're the most film person in the world. He's not really president, but 
Okay. Donald, don't start. Hashtag rigged. Hashtag count the votes. Hashtag perfect call to Georgia. Ask him to find 11,000 more votes. Hashtag I run the deep state, so you better watch it. I love hash browns. That should be our next vote. Best restaurant hash browns. I say Denny's. Joe, we didn't say hash browns. We said... Hey, he won't get it. Let it go. All right, guys. I got to go beat Tiger Woods now, so I'll hop on again later. Okay, me too. Later, brother. Obama out. Bye, Obama. Bye, Joe. Uh, Joe, get a load of this guy. My gosh. Three hours later. All right, guys, what's next? Hey, guys, guys, uh, well, anyway.